Hey everybody, my trip to the guitar show is brought to you by the following brands. Audio Kitchen, Break the Machine, Honey Boy Amps, Lewitt Audio, Orange Amplifiers, Two Notes Audio Engineering, and Zoom. Without those people, these videos would not have been possible, so thank you so much. On with the show! <laughs> Hey everybody, it's the Guitar Show in Birmingham. I'm back, I'm Andy, and so is this. Hey Andy. Hi Andy, how are you doing? <laughs> I'm doing well. <laughs> I like to think about that one. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you forgot my name then. <laughs> so Andy's here at Honey Boy Amps, which are amps and cabs and all kinds of things now that are wonderfully looking and wonderfully sounding. Caveat, I have a Honey Boy amp and I absolutely love it, but now you're doing cabs, right? Yeah, that's right. I mean, we've had our uh, 5 watt, 18 watt, 30 watt, uh, amps out for a time now. Um, with the proliferation of these little heads, I've uh, decided to try and accommodate some of these guys as well with, uh, with the smaller cabs. So, really, I just wanted to make something cute with a six inch cabinet because I had a couple of six inch speakers around. I thought, well, this will be fun. When I heard the thing, wow, you know, I thought they might be able, could be onto something here. So I've got a 2x6 and a 2x8. Uh, they're both in our oak cabinets at the moment. Um, the oak has proven to be a really good foundation for clarity of tone, as you know, when you're from your 5 watt. Um, so we've got the oak in. We're also getting some sapili, which is a, a mahogany substitute. And mahogany's got the rarity factor now. Uh, but um, oak isn't really recognised as a tone wood, and yet we've still got marvellous results out of it. Now, the sapili is a tone wood, say so, mahogany replacement so I've just got a batch of that in now we're going to try that and see how the cabs work with that as well so looking forward to that for the coming year um, the speakers uh, I thought I'd do a mix of Alnico and ceramic if you look at the uh, frequency response charts the difference between the Alnico and the ceramic you see the peaks in different places so if you merge the two together you're going to get a richer and a broader spectrum so that's the idea of putting the, the, the blend of our Nico and ceramic thing. We've got a two by six and a two by eight. I imagined it as a kind of you know home studio um, practice type amp, but the two by eight has been out gigging. The guy toured that red one, 10 dates. He used it as half of his stereo setup nice. uh, with, with a little uh, orange uh, uh, cab as well. But he loved that and he uh, has got a retail outlet in the States. Uh, we're going to be getting them out there to the States this year, hopefully. That's awesome. Um, so he's going, he loves them, he says he can't wait to get them in the shop, and then hopefully we'll follow that with the uh, with the, the combo amps going out there as well. So we're really looking forward to that one. It's amazing, but that's going to have to then switch to 110 volts, right? So. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah we, I mean, we build, we build for the States now. I've sold, to, I've sold to America and uh, Canada, as well as, I don't know, four or five European countries, so, so we're geared up for that. The thing about Honey Boy Amps is there are a lot of people, a lot of players using them that you might not know they're using them. So there's a lot of players on, which, what, what would the scene that you would call at the moment? There's, there's a lot of Jump Blues players? Jump Blues, I mean, well, I, there's a teacher down in London called Chris Cochran, he's got a, he's got a fantastic combo. He, he, he teaches, the people that he teaches see the amp, they come to me and buy one, it's great. It's a little network that's building and building, you know, we love that kind of thing. Okay, well, I'm gonna cut this video with playing, so you will have already heard some playing at the beginning, but I'm gonna play some more now. Are you gonna play a little bit? I'll play a little bit. Yeah, we'll all have a little jam. And uh, what's interesting is we haven't mentioned the price yet. The price is, is that real? 360 on the two by six cab, 394 on the two by eight cab. That's our introductory pricing. So we, we're testing the market and see how we go. And how long do you think you're gonna test it for before uh, we see some actual, conventional pricing on such a great thing. Well, I don't know, we'll have, to, we'll have to see how we go. What I'm trying to say is that if you're liking what you're seeing and hearing, then you should probably contact quick. Andy, yeah. <laughs> yeah <laughs> Get it quick, quick. Yeah. before I buy them all and, and, and no. Thank you so much for watching this, Andy. Thank you. Yeah. Thanks, Andy. Cheers. You're welcome, Andy. All right. And any Andys out there, if your name's Andy, then uh, well done. Five pound off. <laughs> five pound off if your name's Andy. Comment down below. We'll see you soon. This is Birmingham as the Guitar Show 2020. Bye-bye.
Once again, thank you so much to the brands that made this content possible. Without them, you simply wouldn't be watching this. So go and check them out. There are links in the video description down below. There are also plenty more videos in this Guitar Show 2020 playlist, and you can watch those by clicking the link on screen right now. I'll see you in the next video.